Hey, what's up? Rowan here. Welcome back to the channel. Yesterday, I posted over on Instagram a story of a left-handed flick hook at the end of AJ and my training session. Now, AJ likes to finish up his throwing sessions with left-handed throws, mainly to balance everything out, but that got me thinking, is lefty flicks here to stay? Are they going to be the future of ultimate? And I'm just going to take you through a quick thought I have on the subject. The first thing I want to say is I think they're great to just work on, you know, balancing out the body and also teaching yourself a little bit about how to throw. For example, yesterday, you know, just with 10 of those flick hooks, my arm was hurting. And I was like, okay, this can't be right. I'm using too much arm. It's not fluid. You know, normally when you throw, you want to use that whole body just to take it easy on, on the throwing elbow. But my bicep was strained after 10 throws. So I know instantly my form needs work. So to use your left-handed flicks as kind of a teaching method, I think is great to use them to balance out, you know, that pivoting and all the torque that goes on that throwing dominant knee, another good reason. And, you know, after that, I think the flick hooks on the opposite hand probably stop. The one sport I look at as a similarity is basketball, and you see a lot of great players finishing around the rim with their left hand, little layups, dunks, mini little floaters, but no NBA, WNBA, or serious college basketball player is shooting left-handed threes. So in a nutshell, I think that offhand throws in ultimate are very important and will become more prevalent. You know, what started with that little lefty backhand, now we're seeing the lefty scoobers. I do think some, you know, maybe some lefty flick blades come around, but the standstill 60 yard flick hook, I don't see it. I don't think it should be practiced too much unless you're just doing it for fun or, you know, you hurt your dominant hand. Anyways, those are my quick thoughts on the offhand. Practice them, play with them, have fun with them. That's the most important part about throwing. Enjoy it, but when it comes to the games, Focus on your power from your dominant hand and maybe some touch close range throws with the left. All right, take care.